morning and welcome back to our channel. So happy you can join us. You guys probably have noticed this is not how I normally start my vlogs because you're right, it's not. Um, but today is a little bit different than any other day. So obviously if you guys watch my vlogs you knew something was coming up today. I wasn't really specific about it. So um, basically today is my mom's ring the bell ceremony day where she finishes her last chemo treatment and gets to ring that bell and we're all super super excited about it because it just marks the end of a really hard chapter in her life but she overcame it and I'm just so proud of her and I'm gonna try not to get emotional in this vlog so I wanted to take this vlog and um, show my appreciation and just kind of show you guys um, who made me and where I get a lot of my strength and qualities from she is a really amazing person human mom grandmother and I wanted to show you guys a couple of clips from the beginning from when she found out she had cancer till now so I hope you guys really enjoy it it's just some clips from past vlogs and it's been ups and downs hard times and you know but today is to be celebrated because it has a happy ending so I hope you guys enjoy Be healthy, that's for sure. No, for sure. Back in July, I was diagnosed with um, breast cancer, it's in my left breast. Um, they're not sure if it's um, stage one or stage two, they won't know until they go in and do the surgery to find out for sure. I did have an MRI that showed it was not in the lymph nodes, but the doctors say they're not 100% sure until they go in and do surgery. So, um, because of my family history. Um, going to be having um, chemo once a week for four months and then at the end of that they will go in and do surgery to remove whatever's left if there's anything left in there. Um, this morning the surgery I had was I had a port put in um, so that I can receive chemo. Um, the port is because I have really small veins and veins that like to run away from needles. So all they have to do is hook up the chemo directly to my port and they put it in here on the left side and so they won't be having to poke me and try to find my veins all the time and leave bruises and all that kind of stuff. So um, so that's the plan for right now. Um, I've had um, two mammograms, I've had a breast ultrasound, then I had a biopsy. That's how they found out it was cancer and then um, I went to see the oncologist and he feels because of my history this is the best way to hopefully treat the cancer and it's a better outcome that it won't come back this way.
watch you birth Bryce and Steven, but your head is like shaped perfectly. <laughs> it was difficult for the <laughs> Your head is shaped like your dad's. I'm fine, I'm not crying, but curly. That's why my husband is curly and black. I love curly hair. I'm not. You look like you're about to go to prison. You don't look like that. Yeah. So how do you feel, Mom? Um, I feel okay. How was that experience? It was different. Um, There's a lot of people in there supporting you, though. There was a lot of people, yes, that was... That was really cool how everyone was just kind of like really, really sweet to her. Let, they didn't even make her wait. They were like, yep, take a seat real quick. They took care of her, gave her a shampoo, and then let her walk away for free. So that was really cool. So it was, it was, it was really cool. sweet of them. I yeah. Appreciate. See Grandma. <laughs> See her head. You want to shake? You want to feel it? <gasps> what do you think? blanket I had it made and it has like pictures of everybody on it I'll have to show it to you guys soon and um she loves it I got it for her to take to chemo I'm gonna start crying like as soon as she opened it she started crying so um it's just a touchy subject for everybody and we try to make light of it my dad does a really good job of that <laughs> but um i just love her so much and i'm really proud of how strong she's being through this entire thing all right guys we just stopped at Publix and grabbed mom some pretty flowers and we got her a very cute why is my camera uh, balloon, can't see it. but it's a butterfly. She's gonna like it. <laughs> good save, babe. <laughs> I was trying to get a good elevator shot, but the doors were closed. <laughs> <laughs> made it. We gave her her flowers. Good morning. <laughs> no, it's good morning, love. Good morning, love. <laughs> Thank you. Dad's here. Hey. Good morning, love. <laughs> Alright, my friend. This is the dancing girl. She was dancing. <laughs> 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 
So is this your last bag, Mom? My last bag. Woohoo! This is my daughter who's the blogger. The blogger! Yeah. That's awesome. That's the rest of my blogger. Yeah, no, and then I'm not a blogger. <laughs> 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 and the erotic This is my daughter, my future son in law. They're getting married in September. Congratulations. Thank you. My daughter in law, Annielli. My son, Stephen. My daughter, Annie Kinsey. Yeah. My son, Bryce. My daughter, Brittany. <laughs> Awesome, welcome. Now your turn, Lisa. Yeah. Okay, Lisa, <laughs> Do you mind being on YouTube? No, <laughs> uh oh, uh oh, it's okay. Oh, oh, no, your arm is in my body. <laughs> oh, you're done. I was expecting you to like jump up on the chair and do like a dance. I just want to say that when you see me at Walmart, I'll be in street clothes. I'll look at you, but I won't acknowledge you until you recognize me. It's called patient privacy. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. See you guys later.